182,120 square metres of solar photovoltaic panels generating electricity from the sun. They're all mounted on the ground on steel frames over 27 hectares of farmland near Rathnew in County Wicklow. It is seven years since Neon, the company who put all of this together, asked the two farmers who own the land about leasing it out. And despite that seven-year wait for planning permission and construction, both farmers say it was a no-brainer to get involved. We're delighted with it. Myself and Trevor can run the sheep underneath it and maintain it and keep it going. So, and it's obviously sort of like a slight bit of a pension for us, which always helps. So it's good. It is a win-win. I mean, you can't lose. You still use, still farm the ground, and you're producing energy and food. It's the future, and it's here now. Minister Eamon Ryan seemed positively excited to be able to flick the switch and connect the solar farm to the national grid. By switching to our solar power, our wind power, our own resources, we can protect Irish householders, we can tackle climate change, and we can. This is a peace project. This is actually creating security in the world because we will never be held for ransom over solar power, over using our own resources. And that's why it's a big day today. The planning can take a bit of time, but the Wicklow County Council supported us a lot also to get that solar plant approved and to progress. There are 33,600 solar panels in these fields and they're likely to remain here for at least 30 more years because that's how long the farmers have currently leased out their land for. In the meantime, they're going to continue to be able to graze their sheep on the grass underneath while these yokes continue to deliver enough electricity to power 3,600 of our homes. And that sounds like a win-win for all concerned. George Lee, RTE News in County Wicklow.